Let's talk about Jonathan Crane. He talks a lot about fear, something he can no longer feel due to constant exposure to his specially made fear toxin. Well, it, there is one thing that strikes fear into the heart of the boogeyman. Perhaps that is why he despises him so much. Beyond the humiliation he endured at the asylum lies a festering envy. He competes with the Dark Knight in the production of fear, and what a competitor he is. The good Dr. Crane hardly cares who receives his patented brand of terror, though. Batman does. He strikes fear in the hearts of criminals specifically, but more importantly, he also inspires hope in the hearts of the people. Scarecrow knows this, and he hates it. Thus, his insane plan to strip Gotham of all its hope. It's rather pathetic, I think. He can't stand the fact that he isn't in complete control of terror, that there is someone out there that knows how to scare him. Oh, poor, poor Jason Todd. Tortured physically and psychologically for months on end by quite possibly the most deranged psychopath in the Dark Knight's roster. You know, for being the titular villain though, he doesn't end up being as compelling as I feel like he should be. There's a mystery about who he is and how he knows Batman so well, but once it's revealed and Batman beats him, there is no closure. He sort of just fucks off. He does come back to help in the last scene, and at first I didn't really get why. But maybe, just as Bruce beats the Joker in his mind, Jason beats the one in his too. He is far more interesting in hindsight, I think. When the Arkham Knight speaks, he's quick to anger. When he acts, he's impulsive. And in both, he is impatient and very single-minded. From what we learn about Jason Todd, this adds up. He speaks with boiling rage that at times sounds like it may simmer into ugly crying. Don't pretend to understand! It's tragic, really. To have been tortured for so long and to find out once you finally escape that you've been seemingly abandoned by the people you thought were your family. He needs to see a therapist. I really like how the Joker and Scarecrow work together, albeit without meaning to. Batman was already in the process of seeing his worst fear be realized. The Joker in his head was already trying to break him. Crane just got really fucking lucky with his timing. He rarely shows it behind his calculated and collected tone, but he does occasionally display surprise at who it seems the Dark Knight is becoming. Something's changed. You're different. Furthermore, there's a sick irony here. Jason Todd is indirectly working with the Joker, too. Crane and Jason hardly like one another. It's purely a business partnership, but all the shit that they were pushing onto the Dark Knight's plate in combination with the manipulation from the Joker makes this seem quite similar to what Jason himself experienced. Wait. And then we waited. This is Jonathan Banks. <laughs> but it didn't come. Crime actually special Halloween. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> that hurt that looked like it hurt. What's wrong? That's Batman. That's a car. That those are two cars. No, that's a tank. What is that thing? It's a car. It's called a car, man. I thought we were Have you never seen a car before? Before Albuquerque, New Mexico. Albuquerque. What's unusual is that they didn't. It's all coming Gotham. together. It's in the job description, Mr. Wayne. Batwing's on its way. Is that the is is that the actor for the guy from the Telltale Walking Dead games? What's his fucking name? Fucking John Robert, even. The radio and microwave frequencies point to Ace Chemicals. Where else That's would he be making that? Produce. Fucking Best Buy. That's Tank Dempsey. They got Tank Dempsey. They got a kid named Finger. They got, um, they got the. What the fuck are you doing, Batman? What the fuck is happening right now? What the fuck? Okay. Well. Let go. It's a bad idea to drop the elevator while I'm still inside it. <laughs> yeah, yeah it is. It's moving. How are you doing that? 
it's a bad idea to drop the elevator while I'm still behind. <laughs> Hi, you Scarecrow. Really think you've won. Damn, you are not Damn looking good. You How do I shut it down? Let me go. What sh Barbara Gordon. Get out of there. Now. Relax. No one knows I'm here. I can't believe that Batman is going to die. And I can't believe that I have to do this stupid fucking mini game. Okay. She said. Holy shit, that get the shit out of me. What is happening right? Oh my god. Please stop doing that to me. Alf. He said Alf. I'm Batman. Um, 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 I'm Batman. Oh god. The novelty war where's all what? What? Colleen? Is that you again? Wait, wait, <laughs> hold on, what's going on? Candy gram. Hey. Ooh, what the <laughs> Here, Barbara, let me help you. Get up. It's a bad idea to drop the elevator. Well, I'll talk to you later, man. I'll do this on my own. No, you won't. Okay. Stay away from my family. Jim, you need to relax, man. You need to take a breather. She didn't, I didn't bat girl. She bat girled. Before I could, so yeah, he's gone. Whatever. I think that went quite well. You need to get off of that. You don't know what you're doing. Hey, I remember this from Batman Arkham. Oh, this arc. Like, come on, bro. Come on, man. Okay, what the fuck is that, man? What is that? What the fuck? Uh, Bruce, this is your father calling. <laughs> it's time we had a talk, son. You know, about the dressing up. Yeah. <laughs> He's dead. Yeah, this is how you cure mental illness? Just start fighting your delusions? Well, hopefully that doesn't land on anyone. <laughs> That's awesome! No, no. <laughs> and there he is, man of the hour. Just like a regular fucking crook. You dumbass. I still haven't heard from Barbara. Trust me, Robin. She's fine. I promise, I'll hand control of your body right back to my turn. Wait, this is literally the plot to Cyberpunk, bro? There is literally a guy in my head, and we're becoming the- We're merging! We're becoming the same person, bro! This is literally Johnny Silverpunk and V. Bye! No, her name is V. Nah. I don't like green things. Hey, Batman. You wanna hang out? Are you busy, bro? Yeah, I guess it's been a long night, huh? Well, I'll be back the later. Dark Knight must be slain. And the voices are talking to me again. Yep. Dead parents. Never. I'm done taking orders from you. You bastard! Take off that mask, or my next shot will kill him. Never. I'm. Oh, yeah. mm, I'm gonna go on the left. I lied. I lied. Okay, that's a. Oh, you, you fucker! <laughs> Jesus Christ, man! Great. I'm actually playing FNAF at Freddy's now. One of them's gotta be real, right? Holy shit, dude. Fuck this game. Oh my god. Kill him. Kill him one more time. Two t three times. Four. Five. Six. Seven. They have nine lives. Oh no! Alright, I'll see you later, man.
Damn, he's got explosives. Whoa, wait a second. I'm eating something. Where? Hey, hey. Unfortunate news, sir. Members of the League of Assassins. No, have been fuck off. I do. Holy shit, they're dead. It better not be Razor. I will be upset. No, he's not back. Who is this? If that's Raish, I'll kill him. No way! I just don't like Raish. On principle. Like, I, I don't know what principle, but on a principle. Let me tell you. Sorry, Raish. Not really, but... Damn, he does not look good. <laughs> Proud of you. Thanks, Dad. Besides, you can't save all of Barbara. I killed half of her already. Yeah, you're funny, bro. You're funny, bro. I got Ooh. <laughs> you're so lucky you're not real. No. <laughs> what kind of question can only be asked upon reflection? Probably like... Book. No, Dark Knight. You're way off the mark. <laughs> you know, half the crooks in Gotham think I feed you info. You do. Wow, that was just not nice. Mr. Enigma. No! I was just hanging out in hell, and you'll never guess who I saw. That's right! Your dead girlfriend, Talia al Ghul. Now don't worry. Why are you I so asked, mean to me? Totally this game really makes me feel like the, the shit, man. Oh, come on. Bro, you're lying. Oh. Bro, what is happening? Yeah, I don't know why I did that. What do you mean? Oops. Oh, come on, bro. I'm gonna kill myself. I'm actually. I'll purchase. Oh. Oh. My fault. Yeah. 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 Come on. <laughs> I'm not. I just don't. I just don't want to live. I just don't even want to be alive. Okay. No, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. Just wanted to make sure. How should we celebrate? I know a couple of poor, defenseless museums, but then again, I also know a couple of hotels. It's a bad idea to drop the elevator while I'm still inside it. 